Good morning. Welcome to another beautiful day at Gray's Lake. This morning, let's start in Tadasana. Come to Mountain Pose at the top of your mat. Your feet, your toes should be touching your heels just a bit apart. I want you to roll your thighs out, pull your buttocks in and your tummy under. I want you to soften your shoulders and pull your shoulder blades in towards the center and drop your hands to your side. We're going to open our chest. Take deep breath in, three breaths here. We're going to pay attention that our breath is coming from our tummy. And on our next inhale, hands meet overhead. Exhale, we're gonna come into chair. We're gonna pull everything in towards the center. We wanna keep our knees over our toes. We don't want any leg injuries. As always, if you have shoulder pain, hip pain, and there's a position that you don't want to go into, Please go to child's pose, Tadasana, someplace safe. And on our exhale, let's go ahead and come into a forward pull. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, forward pull. Breathe in, come up hands to heart center. Now drop our arms. Let's go ahead and cross over, reach our left shoulder. Let's bring our left arm behind our back and take a twist, looking back over our shoulder. Let's cartwheel our arms and switch sides. And coming back to center, we're going to clasp our hands and lean to the right. <sighs> lean to the left. We're going to clasp our hands behind our back and bending at our hips. We're going to lean forward. And releasing our hands, we're going to meet back in chair. From chair, let's bring our hands to our mat, come back into plank. And we're going to hold our plank for 30 seconds. We're going to lower halfway down, pushing up into upward facing dog, chest open. We're going to push back up and before we go to down dog, we're going to take a little push up and push back into downward facing dog. Let's bring our heels towards the mat. Another deep breath. And next inhale, we're going to bring that right foot up, bending it towards our shoulder. If you're good, stay there. If you need a little more challenge, roll it out into wild thing. Coming back, bring the hands to the mat, leg high, and thread it through. Left arm to the sky. Coming back, bring our hands to the mat, leg high, and step it through. Coming up into a crescent lunge.
Make sure your shoulders are soft and you're breathing. Smile. It's a great day. Cartwheel your hands to the mat, stepping back into plank. Lowering partway down and pushing up. Upward facing dog. Take that little push up and come on back into downward facing dog. Ah. Deep breath in, left leg up. Bend your heel towards your shoulders. Stay there if that's good. Roll it out if you need a little bit more. Roll it back, hand to the mat, leg high. Let's push that leg through and bring that left arm uh, or right arm up to the sky. Cartwheel it back, bringing the left leg up, stepping through. Cartwheel your hands back. And let's come. I've got a root. Sorry, I'm going to move up a little bit. Coming into crescent. Chest open. Big smile on your face. This is our joy flow, ladies, gentlemen. And cartwheeling our hands to the mat, stepping back, lowering part way down, pushing up into upward facing dog. And almost forgot my push up. Back into downward facing dog. I'm gonna drop into our child's pose. And we're going to roll up. We're going to spread our toes on the mat. Our knees are together. You can bring your feet close in. And we're just going to lean back. This is going to help our toes spread out. Help us with our balance a little later on in the practice. And dropping our hands, pushing up into a forward pull. Rolling up. And let's step forward, whoops, into another lunge. From here, we're going to drop our knee and we're going to lengthen our front leg and bend over it. Let's go ahead and bend it, pushing up. We're going to come into a forward pull, lifting our left leg high, bringing it down, rolling up. And exhale down. Let's come back into plank. Lower part way down. And up dog. And push up. And down dog. Let's walk our hands back. And roll up. Stepping off into our lunge. and dropping that knee bend over our front leg and pushing off coming into a pull let's lift that right leg high and planting our feet Rolling up and hands to heart center. Let's come to the center of our mat. If you're outdoors, 
Make sure you have a nice, flat, sturdy area. I'm going to pull everything into the center, tucking our tummy. Pull our shoulders back. Rolling our hips and everything in towards the center. We're going to cross our right arm under our left. We're going to pull our right leg across our left. Bending our knee, we're going to come into Eagle. Whoops. And unwinding, breathe in. Exhale. Nice forward pull. Rolling up. And again, make sure that you're in a nice flat area, pulling everything in towards the center, whoops, left arm under your right, pulling that left leg, you want to make sure and just pull everything in together, I'm sorry, And breathing in, hands meet overhead, exhale, forward pull, rolling up, let's go ahead and come back into plank, and from here we're going to roll to our side, bringing our left arm high into a side plank. Let's take that left arm and reach it through and back. Rolling back to center. A nice firm plank. Long straight lines. Planting our left hand and rolling to the side. We're going to bring our right hand up. We're going to thread it through and reach behind and up, planting our hand into a nice plank. We're going to drop to our knees and come back into child's pose. From here, we're going to plant our hands. We're going to plant our toes and we're going to push into a downward facing dog. Our hips are high, our belly button is pulled in, and our chest is pulled towards our thighs. Three deep breaths here. And on our next inhale, that right foot comes up. We are going into sleeping pigeon. We are going to pull our leg up. Our right knee is going to point to the outside of our mat. Our foot is going to point to the left side of our mat. Now, you're fine here if you want to stay here. Or if you want to come into sleeping pigeon, walk your arms out. If you're fine here, stay. If you want a little bit more, bend the toes on your left foot and raise that leg. And let it go. Walk your hands back, pushing up. We're going to pop that right leg back into downward facing dog. And on our next inhale, left foot comes up high. We're going to pull it through. Left knee out to the left side of your mat. Right foot 
our left foot out to the right side of your mat. Walk your arms out if you choose. If you choose, tuck your toes under and lift that back leg. And walking your hands back, rolling your spine up. And pop that left leg back into downward facing dog. From here, we're going to take a deep breath in, and we're going to pull that right knee to our left elbow. And take a deep breath in and lift it high and pull it to our right elbow and in and up and down and breathing in left leg comes up knee to right elbow and up knee to left elbow and up and down and pushing forward into plank we're going to lower all the way to the ground from here center yourself shoulders and hips we're going to come into our locust position by rolling everything into the center your tummy is tight you know squeeze your glutes you're gonna squeeze your shoulder blades and exhale and one more time breathe in and exhale Hands to shoulders, legs straight out tight. And we're going to use our back muscles to roll up and exhale. And roll up and exhale. And deep breath in. Let's push back to child's pose rolling up we're going to transition our feet in front of us we're going to plant our feet to the outside of our mat moving our hips towards our heels planting our arms by our side our knees should be out over our feet not pulled in and as we breathe in we're going to roll up. You can leave your arms by your side or you can clasp them. Clasp your hands underneath and come into a bridge. Deep breath in and on our exhale, one vertebrae at a time, we're going to roll down. Bringing our knees into our chest in a roll side to side. Extending our left foot out, we're going to keep that right knee where it's at, and then we're going to take our left hand. Let's bring our right arm out to the side and take our left knee across our body. Look over your right arm. and release bringing that right leg back to the mat let's pull that left knee in and give it a squeeze extend your left arm take that right knee across your body gazing over your left arm and 
release. Release that left leg to the mat. We're going to plant that left foot. We're going to take our right leg and bring it across. Flex your feet, both of them. And we're going to take that leg and pull it towards us into a four square position, keeping our shoulders and our head firmly planted on the mat. And release the left foot to the mat. Give that ankle a little roll and plant the right foot. Let's take that left foot across our right knee. And let's go ahead and grab our right leg and pull it in. Go ahead and plant that right foot. Let's give that left foot a little roll and plant it. Let's go ahead and bring our feet out. Center ourselves, our shoulders on the mat, our hips straight. And on our next breath in, we are going to bring that right foot up. We can come into a toe hold. If you have a strap, you can wrap it around. A towel will do. Or just do your little toe hold. And we're going to take our right foot, pulling it across our left, looking over our right shoulder. And back to center. Let's go ahead and grab it with our right hand. Let's look over our left arm. Pulling our leg to the right. And back to center. Let's release that leg down. Let's bring our left leg up. Let's grab it with our right hand and cross over. Bringing it back to center. Let's grab it with our left hand and taking it across. And bringing it back to center. Let's release that leg to the mat. Let's go ahead, bring our legs up. Let's do a little rock back and forth. Coming up into a boat position. And let's bring our feet to the mat, pushing up, rolling forward into a forward pull. And on our next breath in, hands meet overhead to heart center, stepping back into a lunge. I'm going to make sure your hips are aligned. Don't arch your back. Everything's the way it was, tummy tucked, bum under. Coming to the center. We're coming into a goddess position, strong position. Coming into a lunge. Coming back to center. We're going to bend forward. We're going to bring our legs under us. Come into a seated position. From here, we're going to bring our hands to meet overhead 
and to heart center. We're going to pay attention to our breath, soften our breath. On this glorious day, we're thankful for the sunshine and the birds, the water behind us, and the trees overhead. We're going to take this wonderful spark that we have within us and we're going to share it with everybody we meet today. The light in me honors the light in you. Namaste.